Champions' last home game of the season is sure to be a celebration of an incredible promotion campaign for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Great goals, phenomenal wins, and currently on a four-game win streak without conceding. The only thing that could put a dampener on the occasion will be a visiting Sheffield Wednesday causing a loss in front of the jubilant home faithful. The Owls had a rejuvenated end to their campaign. Impressive win against Reading last weekend. Jos Lukai wants his side to continue what they've shown and perhaps show that they're a force to be reckoned with next season. Ball through looking for a phobic. That's another good pass into the striker. Looking for options in the box, looking for support. Might try and go alone here. Eventually look for the pass across goal. Here's Neves. He can score from pretty much anywhere. The effort eventually. Safety wide of Dawson's goal. No way through. Well cut out by Adam Reach, but they're not clear completely just yet. That's an awful back pass as well. Fobe's onto it. Was he trying to be too unselfish and guided across goal for a teammate that wasn't arriving? Wolves confident and composed in possession, as you would expect from the side looking to try and finish the season strongly and drilled straight into the arms of Dawson once again. It's just been lacking their final finish. Whipped in ball to the back post. It's off the post, I think. Wide of the target. Saiz with another chance. He's had a couple this game so far. Given away to Barry Bannon, who went lunging in. His touch was heavy, though. He's back in possession. Costa once more. He threaded in towards a Fobe. He left it. And the eventual effort saved by Dawson. I get the feeling that there is very little on the line for this game. Some of the sloppiness in the passing. The lack of crispness and quality. And shown perhaps with the strike from Reigns that just dribbles wide of the target. A good ball back in again and the header is off the mark. Could have easily been the breakthrough for the captain, Danny Bart. Rules will have plenty of space to move into now in the heart of the pitch. It's a lovely touch by Costa to get away from his marker. Doherty ahead of him in support. Say threads it in to Jota. Dawson sticks a hand out and palms it away. Lunging challenge and able to skip away Eno Bakari. Ball's gone all the way through to the back post. Doherty lays it off. Someone's got to pull the trigger. And that man Saiz is off the mark once again. He just hasn't had his shooting boots on. Back again to Saiz. Little dink through, and a Bakare in behind. Best chance Wolves have had in a while. And the forward dragged it well wide of the target in the end. He'll be frustrated with his finishing this afternoon. Ball forward easily cleared away. That's all she wrote at the Molyneux, the final home game of the season for Wolverhampton Wanderers ends goalless a slightly apathetic end to an incredible campaign with still one more game to play all that's left now though is for Wolves to lift the championship trophy to fifth straight clean sheet for the home side as Sheffield Wednesday are able to hold the champions to a goalless draw it's another valuable point that shows off Josla Huke's side's improvement this season but it finishes Wolverhampton Wanderers nil Sheffield Wednesday nil and the trophy presentation to come the moment Wolves fans have been waiting for Danny Bart and Connor Cody lift the Skybet Championship trophy. Crown champions in the second to last game of the season on home soil. They weren't going to get away with it for too long. Nuno Espirito Santo and his backroom staff covered in champagne. What an impact this manager has had and what a season that Wolverhampton Wanderers have had. Champions of the championship.